Hey guys, Ghetto Gypsy here. Starting off uh, with a bang after my 1,000 subscribers. Uh, I'm going to start off doing uh, Marvel Legends reviews from here on end. Let's see how it goes. Uh, I started to do... Uh, let's start with my first uh, review. I'm going to do the uh, two-pack, the Domino and uh, Cannonball uh, two-pack that came out. Uh, so basically, Cannonball's the one in the purple, and Domino's this one over here. So let's start off with Cannonball, okay? Okay, here's Cannonball. So basically, this is him in his like older type costume. Uh, this is when he, I think he made his first appearance in this one. Um, it's a good figure, like it looks like Cannonball. Uh, the only thing that annoys me, I don't know if I have anybody else has these problems, it's with the feet. Uh, the joint on the feet on mine are really loose. So basically, if you push him over, bang, falls. It's his feet over here are really, really bendy and very loose. So that's the problem I have on for him. And he poses still okay, but you have to put his feet kind of in a crooked way because if they're if he stands like a regular person too much, he'll fall right flat on his face like he's drunk or something. So basically, the only material that's on him is his collar, which looks pretty cool. Uh, head has articulation. I'm not going to go through the whole articulation thing because everybody else does that, but, you know, knees bend. Um, he doesn't uh, doesn't have a joint over here to make him bend forwards. He bends like that, kind of like that Scarlet Witch from uh, the Rider series, which is kind of stupid. I don't know why they did that, but, you know, um, he has torso articulation and whatever. So this is Cannonball. There you go. Still a must-have if you want to collect uh, X-Force or X-Men, uh, especially now with Warpath coming out in the next series. Uh, you know, if you get him, Cable, Domino, you get a custom Feral, but not everybody's into customizing. Uh, I'm a little bit into it, kind of. So anyways, that's Cannonball. Okay, here's Domino. I really like this figure as in the look. You know, it looks like Domino. It's pretty good. Uh, one thing that really annoys me, I think this came in the packaging, uh, it's a packaging issue or whatever, but her left leg, you can see, is really bendy, it kind of goes outwards a lot, so she can't keep her leg straight, like total whore. Anyway, so, she, she could still stand, it's pretty good, I, I got into this pose right with the gun like this, actually, that's a little bit higher. Yeah, it is her, but it's too slanted. I don't know if you guys could notice this on the camera. It's kind of annoying, but you know what? It's a good figure. She doesn't have that great articulation like in the legs, uh, but the upper torso and everything else is pretty cool. So she's another must-have if you want to do, uh, you know, an X-Force display. So anyway, so this was uh, Cannonball and Domino, two X-Force members, pretty good. Uh, like I said, I'm not really big on doing reviews because everybody else does reviews. So these are the ones that I have. They're okay, despite their little flaws. So you know what? Uh, that's about it. So thanks for tuning in, guys.